Now let's see another question code RR and uh, NEET 2018 is question number 85. It is from evolution chapter in 12th class. The similarity of bone structure in four limbs of many vertebrates is an example of. Now students we know that the four limbs of man are for grabbing things, the four limbs of cheetah is for running, the four limbs of whale is for swimming, the four limbs of bat is for flying. So they have different different functions because of the different habits, habits and habitats but they have the same structure, same origin and the organs which have the same origin and different functions are called homologous organs. So this is an example of homology. Whereas analogous are the organs which have the different origin but same function due to sharing of habitat. Analogy is an example of convergent evolution and adaptive radiation also means that they have different origins but they are living together in the same type of, uh, uh, I am sorry, adaptive radiation means that they have a common point but due to different different habitats, there they have you know radiated like adaptive radiation in marsupials, adaptive radiation in placenta, we placental mammals we read but here this is a direct example of homologous organs that is homology answer is option number three next question rr code need 2018 question number 86 in which disease does mosquito transmitted pathogen causes chronic inflammation of lymphatic vessels now students ringworm we know is a fungal disease and there is no transmission by mosquito in ringworm it is not at all associated Ascariasis, we know it is due to the Ascaris lumbricoides, which is a round worm. And in this also, there is no mention of any mosquito bite. It is not transmitted by any mosquito bite. It is by the ingestion of the eggs of the Ascaris. So this is also could not be the answer. Elephantiasis or Filariasis. This is caused by a round worm, which is Bucraria bancrofti or sometimes Bucraria malaya and these roundworms, parasitic roundworms are transmitted by the bite of female Culex mosquito and then when they enter into the human body, they affect lymphatic vessels, they cause their inflammation and it leads to the gross abnormality of the lower limbs of the genital region. You remember the Hathi Pau disease in which the legs, the genital, the scrotum become swollen. So this is the answer because it is transmitted by mosquito. Chronic inflammation of lymphatic vessels occurs. So both the criteria are getting fulfilled. Amoebiasis is basically caused by ant amoeba histolytica and this is also caused by ingestion of food and water contaminated with the cyst of these ant amoeba histolytica. So all the other three options 1, 2 and 4 are not related to mosquito bite and not related to lymphatic system. Answer is option number 3. Now students the next question in RR code of NEET 2018 is question number 87. Which of the following is not an autoimmune disease? Not an autoimmune. Autoimmune means in which our own body forms antibodies against our own cells. Right now. The first option is Alzheimer's. Now Alzheimer's we have read in nervous system students that it is caused due to decreased acetylcholine. There is progressive dementia, loss of memory which we have seen in the movie Black also. Amitabh Bachchan was suffering from this Alzheimer's disease only and it is generally considered due to gene mutation. Rheumatoid arthritis we know it's an autoimmune disease and in this antibodies are formed against the synovial membrane. So yes this is an autoimmune disorder. Psoriasis is again uh, in a uh, skin disease and this is also thought to be because of autoimmunity and vitiligo that means white patches on the skin this is also skin disorder this has also uh, been found to be associated with autoimmune immunity so basically the answer is answer one now students please note that this is uh, you know, um, uh, actually if we look into the details of this question then now the researches as they are going on, the scientists are also indicating that there could be some Alzheimer's which could be because of, sometimes Alzheimer's could also be because of autoimmunity. So actually now all of these are considered to have role of autoimmunity in their causation. But at our level, at NEAT level, definitely according to me, the best answer should be Alzheimer's because these three are definitely autoimmune disorders. 
so according to me the best answer would be answer 1 now students let us discuss the last question from the zoology part in rr code need 2018 and it is question number 89 question 90 will be discussed in the botany section among the following set of examples of divergent evolution select the incorrect option now in these questions we have to be very careful they are asking incorrect options divergent evolution means they must be having a common origin a common ancestor and then because of different different habitats they have evolved into different different organs performing different different functions so basically here are given homologous organ sets homologous organs are given and we have to find out the incorrect that means which one is not homologous now brain of bat man and cheetah these all three are mammals so the brain are definitely homologous so this could not be the answer heart of bat man and cheetah again we know they all are mammals so same origin so these two have the same origin they all are homologous four limbs of bat man and cheetah again i just told you our four limbs have uh, uh, you know evolved to grab things bat for flying cheetah for running but the origin is same so brain heart and four limbs of all these three animals are examples of homologous organs let us see the fourth option eye of octopus bat and man now students octopus is a mollusk it is a non chordata and bat and mammals are bat and man are mammals that means vertebrates that means chordates in chordates also they are the most specialized ones so definitely they could not have the same origin so they do not have same origin but because they are performing eyes are performing the same function of vision that is why this is an example of convergent evolution or students analogous organs and this would be our answer because they have asked which of the following is not homologous so this is not homologous so the answer is answer 4 now students just a line of word I am sure that after seeing all the video solutions most of you must be very happy to uh, uh, get most of the answers correct which is very good I hope that you all get a very good college a very dream college of yours but students even if you have not performed that well don't lose half uh, don't lose hope because uh, in nature there is a place for everyone and we just have to follow our heart we just have to work hard and everything has its own time to take place so don't lose hope don't lose heart there's always a next time so all the best to you and uh, very best of luck for the result thank you